everyone. Uh, big news today for a small country. Liechtenstein has just been added to Google Maps, which means it has been added to GeoGuessr, which is very exciting. Uh, always fun to get a new country, have a look around. Uh, so I'm gonna play. I'm gonna play this map. I'm gonna play moving. We're gonna just look around. It's gonna be very chill. I will try and get a perfect score, but it's a very small country, so like little margins of error um, are less forgivable. So. If we don't quite get the 25k, that's fine. Um, I'm gonna briefly with you have a look through this Plunkett guide, which just dropped. Um, nice work to the Plunkett team because uh, this, this this was not here yesterday, and now it is, and it seems like a pretty extensive guide already. So we'll just have a quick look through together at some Liechtensteinian things, uh, if that's how that's said. <laughs> So the flag, red and blue with a crown, pretty simple, but recognizable most of the time. Don't confuse it with Haiti. Uh, dot .li, they drive right, 100% gem 4, all from this August, I believe. Um, plates are pretty recognizable because they're not EU plates. They've got this little red and yellow bit, which you can see through the blur quite easily. The rest of it's just kind of black. Um, very mountainous, obviously. Low cam, which can be useful if, if you're trying to identify it uh, on like a world map, I guess. I, I'm a pretty casual player. I can't really tell the difference between regular cam and low cam, to be honest with you. So black and white cylindrical bollards. Okay, are these unique? Switzerland uses the same. Okay, green and white bus stop, cool. White and blue road signs, typically. Excellent. Uh, same as the Swiss sign, so seven stripes um, with a man moseying across the road. Yellow and black road separators. Same as Switzerland. Okay, so we're sensing a theme uh, that they use a lot of Swiss stuff. So it could, and because Swiss, Switzerland also has the low cam, doesn't it? So it might be difficult if you're doing like country streaks or something. Metal border around the signs. Um, if you're doing country streaks to tell the difference between Switzerland and Liechtenstein. Um, Alpine architecture, nothing too unexpected here. So, here's region specific clues. We may be, I won't go into this too much, I'll just scroll through. You can have a look at this yourself, I'll put it in the description. Um, but basically, it's quite mountainous. <laughs> um, yeah, some distinctive features in different areas, um, but I mean, I'm just excited to get into the map and have a look around, see how we go. We'll play moving no time limit. All right, here we are. Seems quite forested. Uh, I don't see any mountains. Kind of surprising. It does feel quite hilly though. Rubber dog? Sure. <laughs> uh, let's go up this hill, shall we? It looks very nice. It looks very, uh... Oh, we might have some mountains over here. Some logging happening. Yeah, there's our, there's our Lichtensteinian mountains. What in the hell is this? <laughs> Sure. I won't ask any questions. Uh, okay. Is this a flag? No, maybe not. This is interesting architecture. This like, it's kind of, I don't know. It's a strange shape. It does look very alpine. Look at this. Yeah, we got shutters and everything. Similar to Switzerland and Austria, obviously. Although this is not Alpine, this is a... Uh, strange. <laughs> um, do we have the plates? I don't know. That doesn't look... It doesn't look like the uh, plate we saw before. Frickbau Kundenauer. Sure. Okay, we have a weird mix of like alpine stuff and then this kind of modern looking... How... 
houses, I guess. Okay, so there's the plate. You can kind of see the red and the yellow, and then the dot li. Whole spell, no bell? Is that a place? Uh, where, where are we? Here. Whole spell. The nice thing about small countries is you can scan them for place names pretty easily. Oh, I see some holts over here. Holts power. Uh, all right, I'm gonna keep looking around. I think that area, okay, we can't go that way. Okay. So, to our east, we have Hinterschloss, Gentenstein, Hinter, Tostnerwald, Hinter, Of der Egg, and St. Corneli. Oh, are these like biking tracks? I think we're somewhere in this area. The signs are kind of confusing me, so I think I'm gonna just go down this road and have a bit more of a look around. Look at these mountains, they're really cool. What are these? Just some garden flower, I think, but they're quite cool looking. Very bulbous. <laughs> uh, we can't go that way, apparently. That's uh, actually quite sad. Oh, that's fun. It is a very nice looking part of the world, I will say. Can we go up that hill, maybe? No. Okay, so if we can't go that way, and we can't go that way, I guess we just go back to the start and go a different way. Let's maybe go down the hill this time. So we have a little village at the top of the hill that we're on. It's, I, I don't know if I'd even call it a village, it's very small. What is happening here? We're all on the side of the road. I think we're in like a, a national park might be a generous term. I don't know if they have those, um, but some kind of like around these tracks, because there's a lot of, I think that's what those, oh, there's, there's another example of the plate. It is very distinctive, actually. That's quite useful. Especially for, for if you're not sure, if you're in Switzerland, you can look at those plates because they're very, okay. Schlossweg. Yeah, these bike tracks. Schlossweg. Hmm. Las <laughs> Um Okay. Which way do we want to go? Look at these mountains. It's so nice. Uh, okay. Well, that might be useful to me if I could actually see it, but I definitely can't, so that's okay. Um, oh, we've got a skate. Okay, this seems like a pretty touristy area for like outdoorsy people. Sport house, yeah. Parkplatz. I think Parkplatz is just a car park, right? Oh, look at this fetching gentleman in his excellent hat. Yeah, so there's the crossing sign. Um, is this the way we want to be going? Sport und Friesian Friesetanlage. I don't speak German. So much so that I'm not even a hundred percent sure that this is German. I, I think it is. It seems. It seems. It seems Germanish. Ah, this is where the Liechtensteinian national team plays would be my guess, uh, if they have one. Do they have one? They must do, right? Yeah, we've got a bunch of like trails, some more logging happening, and then, yeah, what are these like 
houses made half of wood and half of, uh, I guess, stone or concrete or whatever. Um, is that a Liechtenstein thing, or is that just this specific, like, alpine region? Because it's very interesting looking. I, I don't think I've seen it around too much. I know we're still around one, I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, I just, uh, I'm not sure where we are, so. But this is the point, right? Have a look around a fun new country. Um, I might send soon though. In the area that I think we are. I could be very wrong. Yeah, this is like a weird kind of sports facility. Like, it's an outdoor gym and we had a skate ramp and we had like a soccer pitch and we had biking trails. Like, it seems like a fun place to be. Yeah, what are the- this is very specific looking. Is this- I wonder- I don't know enough about alpine architecture. We've got shutters, which I know you do get in, in Switzerland quite a lot as well. Alright, I'm gonna click uh, Like here, I think that's plausible. I think we're in that area. Schlossweg was us, just the street we're on, okay. Uh, yeah, just two k's up the road. That's fine. Uh, it was Unterland, so we're on a state streak, which I've left on. I was doing some Australia games earlier. <laughs> um, I didn't even know Liechtenstein had states, but that's cool. Ah. This is quite a distinctive mountain. Like that shape is like this. I feel like I feel like that's quite recognizable. That's probably Ooh, fruit trees. I get very distracted. I don't know. <laughs> One of my favorite parts of GeoGuessr is just like looking around at fun different things. From out Gatla, 1982. Okay, we're looking down at the valley. There's a river. Looking down at the valley, and there's a river. Does Vaduz have a river? It does. We could be somewhere up here ish, I guess, then. Um. Look at these switchbacks, this has got to be very mountainous. Oh, I should have put training mode on so I could use the terrain feature. That's one of my favorite things when learning a new place is, is being able to see the terrain because it's just so useful. Especially in such a mountainous country. We, where are we? Okay. Couldn't tell you what that says. I'm sure, some of you can tell me what that says. Yeah, we're looking down at the river. There's a giant mountain on the other side to our west. Okay, big mountain west. Could it be Elbspitz? Are we like on this side? No, I don't think so. I think we'd be in Switzerland if we were over here. So... What are we looking at then? Hmm. I don't know. Got more... fun looking houses. Okay, let's have a look at this street sign. We're on Litzistras. Wonderberg. Is that a place? Wonderberg? Okay, close. <laughs> uh, yeah, none of this is that. Uh, that's fine, let's go down this way, if possible. Not possible. Okay, let's go up this way then. A 
love this architecture. It's so different from Australian architecture. Uh, look at this. Look at this. Okay. So it's a pretty big river and it's curving from the south to the west. Curving from the south to the west. We could be looking into Switzerland as a possibility across the Rhine. So that's to our west though. So the river the rivers to our west and the mountains to our west. Is there a big mountain in Austria? No, Switzerland. Big mountain in Switzerland. Uh, I mean, yes, <laughs> is the obvious answer to that question. We could be up on this hill, I guess? Like looking down at, at here and then across and then at these mountains over here? I don't know, I'm a little lost. I'm a little lost. Um. Oh, is that a bunny rabbit? <laughs> uh, I don't think heading up the hill is really gonna take me anywhere. What is this monstrosity? Mm. Okay. Ah, we got a lot of flags. I love countries where they love their flag, because it is very useful. Um, Turkey especially, just legendary. Okay, there's another plate. I'm gonna be honest, we might have to just, to just uh, do a vibes guess here because I'm not really finding any information that's helpful. Have a look at this sign. Haldastras. Okay. Street names not super helpful to me. I'm gonna put us like in Barg. But I'm really not sure. I'm really not sure. I'm assuming we're looking at the Rhine. Yeah, okay. Not the worst. Not the worst. We yeah, we were just kind of lost in these, like, residential mountainous roads. I mean, how do you even get out of here? <laughs> you go up here, and then that way, and then that way, and then that way, yeah. I don't think I was finding a way out of that. Um, yeah. We're on a state streak still, so that's something. Okay. Is this one of those green bus stops? Erstads? Hittestel? Cool. Sean. I know that. That's up here. Nope, that's down here. Nope, wait, where is that? It's here, okay. And we're leaving Planken? Planken. Okay, so we're on this road. Probably here, right? Thank you, Matag. Cool. Kinder. <laughs> it's a little creepy, I'm not gonna lie. But, you know. You do you, Liechtenstein. Okay. Um, Alright, this might be a no move 5k. Let's see if we can line up this road. Does this fit? Hmm. Not as much as I would like it to. Does this fit? Yeah. Do we have Off de Agatha? Alright, we're gonna move. I. It's a little overexposed. In a in a pretty typical Gen 4 way. Vorder Planken? Vorder. Does that mean like 
south. I don't know. <laughs> um, what's happening over here? Ostgenomen Fortwirtschaft. Okay. Okay. That's not especially useful to me. Uh, we're leaving Pen Pen Plankin and we're entering Strauss. No, Shah. I just read that word. So we're so we are somewhere on, on this road, I think, but I'm not quite sure exactly where. Can I get the name of this bus stop? No. Um, okay. Okay. Mm, let's head towards Sean then. So we're on a very forested road. It's a bit windy. Going down the mountain. It's very nice looking again. Ooh, we got a bunch of water things. Okay. Keep heading in this direction. Got a single traffic light. Why do we have a single traffic light? It's a little interesting. Okay, we've got to switch back. Is there an off road at the edge of that? I mean, yeah, kind of. This could be this. Uh, does the angle work? Yeah, it kind of does. Okay, I think this is our bus stop then. I could be wrong, but I don't want to spend too much more time. Very nice. It was Oberland again. Is it? Is that the one state of Liechtenstein? I, I can't say I've memorized the states of Liechtenstein. So, <laughs> okay. What is this? This is very interesting. What are these windows doing? They're a little, uh... F from, from out? Sure, okay. So, we're on a road, it's north to south. We got some, uh, lovely individuals on bikes. Uh, let's head towards this sign. This is another bus stop. Okay, that's quite useful. Feldkirch and Sean are to our east, and Books and Vaduz are to our south. To our east? Huh? To our east? Yeah. <laughs> Feldkirch. Oh, we might be. Oh, oh, okay, okay. 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 Are we on this road? Ben Bendera Strauss. I think it's possible. I think it's very possible. In industry bow dot D E. Okay. Good to know. Sometimes you might see dot .de, don't click Germany. Um, those are some mountains, dude. Look at those. I guess it is literally the Alps. But I just like, like, look at them. Very cool. Okay, is there a roundabout on this road? Yeah, I think we're here. Ish. Um, can I get a street name? Industry Strauss is to our west. I would, I would say that this probably is called Industry Strauss just because of, of the buildings on it. I'd love an actual street name, but I don't know if that's happening. Saint Gallen and Bendern are up the road we just came. Bendern, yeah. 
Yeah, I'm gonna guess. Okay. Uh, I probably could have pinpointed that, but it's not the end of the world. We got the road. Tractor. Alright. <laughs> also got dot ch. Okay, so maybe uh, when you're in the Alps, don't pay too much attention to domains because, um, yeah, if I didn't know this was Liechtenstein, I would have sent Switzerland there because it does look so similar. We got that weird sign again. Oh, can I not go up the road? It's very sad. Um, the like peace sign with the vehicles in it. Is that a church in the distance to our south? Might be. Okay. The roads seem mostly pretty narrow. Vidriet. Okay. What's this street called? Telagaveg? Okay, we've got- I think this is corn. They got corn in the Alps? It's a bit interesting. Um, yeah, you wouldn't think you grow crops on mountains, but I guess there are some flat bits. Are these Italian poles? I don't know. I don't know my European poles very well. I did kind of learn them back in the day, but... Hmm. I don't know what that says, but it, I've seen it three times now, so... It might be a meta. The Liechtenstein. Unclear. Okay. Should we head towards the church, or should we head... What does this say? Bio ear el product fish house imaged. Cool. Uh, yeah, let's head towards the church. Look at this walking infrastructure and cycling infrastructure. It's so wonderful. <laughs> Imagine having paths for bikes and pedestrians. <laughs> What does this say? Okay. Um, I'm unsure if any of those are place names. So I'm just gonna keep going. What is this sign? It's the same sign, but with a heart. How lovely. Okay. We have this reddish road. Am I imagining things? It's got a kind of red tint to it. It's pretty straight. I think we're in a valley. Lots of corn, which is so interesting. I, do you get, I guess you do get that up here. I just haven't really seen it. I kind of associate the Alps with like extremely mountainous roads where you, you wouldn't really have fields like this. I would try fast moving, but um, my internet's not really good enough for that. And also, the last time I tried that, I uh, had a guess down <laughs> and I tried to fast move to find the 5k and uh, I guessed my guess by pressing space. Um, so we're just going to enjoy the view. Okay, we're near Bendern again, which does not surprise me, because um, this was where the kind of sporty stuff was happening, wasn't it? We could be on Heldenstrasse, I guess. What's the road angle? Um, okay, we're not on Heldenstrasse. Is there any roads that fit this? Uh, oh, we could be somewhere. Oh, wait. 
Didn't we have industry stress about like two minutes ago? Am I crazy? Oh, you know what? Are we on the same road? <laughs> it does, it does line up. Uh, I think it's possible. <laughs> to be honest, I think it's possible. Let's keep going. You know what? Is that that same building with the weird drunken windows? It totally is. Okay, we're on the same. We're on the same road. We're on the same road. <laughs> I guess you know what, Liechtenstein, small country. That's gonna happen. So what happened? We headed west. We then headed north. On a curvy road that then goes straight west. Uh, what road did we decide we were on? <laughs> Here, okay. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. We're at the farm shop, guys. We're at the farm shop. Um, okay. Yeah. So, headed west. Then it goes straight that way and straight that way. Headed west? Then it goes straight that way. Okay, I think we're like here. I'm not 100% sure. Three meters. Not so bad. Um, is that a silver medal? We'll take those. We'll take those. 19,000 points. Um, yeah, what a, what a very nice looking country. Very pretty. Uh, lovely mountains. Nice and green. Lots of very fun architecture. Um, I can't believe we were in, we were on the same road. That's quite funny for round four and five. Uh, but yeah, that's Liechtenstein. I'm very excited to see it pop up on world maps. See if I can identify it. We've, we've, um, had a, had a good look around. So I think I, I kind of know what I'm looking for. Um, but yeah, let me know how you've been enjoying Liechtenstein and, uh, I'll see you later.